piece is called Ode to a Lily Pad. Oh, Lily, love your pad. Flat, green, textured, burnished by the sun. Multi-petal beauty, white with pink tips. How is it you live in slime? <laughs> This, this is called Job Diary. Monday, the woman with two cats calls. I'd like to hire you, but I ran into a neighbor whose daughter is unemployed. The girl's a little off. You know what I mean? She's not going to last long. I'm sure I'll be calling you in a couple of weeks. <laughs> Tuesday, phone call. Ray Job on Craigslist. The woman asks, what's the lowest salary you're willing to accept? <laughs> Wednesday, meet Kim at a cafe on 8th Avenue. She arrives 20 minutes late, insists on a table by the window. I order orange juice, and she an apple martini and a cheese platter. You probably won't take it, but would you consider a part-time sales job working on commission? $25 on each sale? No, I respond. She wraps up the cheese and says, I hope you don't mind. I have to return to the office. Thursday. Can you interview on Friday at 5.30 or Saturday at 10 a.m.? Would you please remind me, what's the position in the name of the organization? EA to the president. Great. We'll be at the bar at the Pierre. Friday morning, I email asking the URL rockland.org. Something isn't right. Right it is. Rockland is a neoconservative right wing organization. <laughs> Without explanation, I cancel the interview. Too bad about the Pierre. And the Apple Martini. This is lack of a chair. In my old apartment, never a comfortable place to sit. A brown futon, two metal chairs, and a step stool. When I moved to Astoria, for $100, I bought a maroon Carlisle sofa, an orange velvet lazy boy, and a frame drawing of a chair. <laughs> Thank you.